Hello, my name is Rick. I'm a microscope sales specialist with Mager Scientific, an Icon microscope dealer. Today we will be discussing the SMZ18 stereo microscope and how to configure it as a high-end digital microscope system. The SMZ18 is a research-grade stereo microscope that has an extremely large zoom range and high-resolution capability. It also features state-of-the-art SHR Plant Apple series lenses that deliver brilliant images with true-to-life colors. The system features a built-in motorized Z-Drive for automatically creating all-in-focus images from multiple Z-planes or stacks. One of the key features of the system is that it incorporates intelligent communication of magnification between the microscope and software, eliminating user error and selecting calibrations. In order to configure the SMZ18 as a digital microscope, we'll be adding an Icon DS RI2 16 megapixel color camera, a prior motorized XY stage, which has 4 inch by 3 inch travel for image stitching, and Nikon Elements software, a powerful yet user friendly software environment that will integrate the entire system. There are many advantages of using a traditional optical microscope as the basis of a digital system. Having eyepieces to look through provides the ability to visualize your sample in stereo or 3D view. This sometimes allows you to see features that can't be captured by a camera. You have the ability to upgrade cameras over the life of the microscope. The microscope may last over 20 years, but camera technology advances at a more rapid pace. Nikon's high quality optics are utilized in the system, producing outstanding image results. And this is one of the most cost effective, versatile, research grade systems on the market. So that's a brief overview of the research grade SMZ18 digital microscope system. We have a separate video that provides a comprehensive walkthrough of the SMZ18's options and features. Additional videos will show in-depth demonstrations of imaging techniques such as capturing all-in-focus images and image stitching.